Uh, so this past week I've been playing this game called Monster, Monster Hunter Adventure. World. Uh, I don't know if you guys have heard about it. it. Came out a few years ago. It's all right. Did you guys beat that game? Monster Hunter World? Yeah. No. I hardly played it. I played it a buttload, and I'm at the the very end of like the like story. I just haven't gone back to like actually finish it. Oh. I think we're on like the last monster that we have to. Well, you guys know what's been happening and how I've never played this franchise until now, and it's happening. Oh, really? It's happening. I'm I'm switching into enjoying this game, and I didn't think I would be uh, so much. You guys know what happened Thursday. Uh, I got the itch on Saturday, and I just like pulled up the game again just to like check out the menus and stuff. Uh, did that on stream, and a lot of people were excited about menus, but it's starting to click in, t in terms of like how do you move in this game, how you actually have to feel kind of the weight of the weapon, wait for the animation. Um, so yeah, it's all, it's all coming good, coming together good. But I'm sure if anyone wants to hear my Monster Hunter thoughts, they can just watch the journals. It was it was really cool seeing you like play that like especially through the tutorial and like watch it like I could see it like start to click with you and I was like ah he's getting it finally yes he understands like especially when you picked up the hammer and did that double jump off the wall into the slam yeah you were like <laughs> <laughs> and you know I don't think I would have gone that without people telling me to do it and a lot of people and I think we talked about this on an episode a while back. A lot, everybody says you have to enter this fran this franchise either with the will to do a lot of research and study or with a veteran who can show you the ropes. In my case, I had 600 people yelling at me what to do. So that was very helpful. <laughs> um, but yeah, what a fascinating game. I don't know if there's an... I've never witnessed another franchise which needed... Like I needed so much external explanation and guidance into how to play it. And if it wasn't streamed... If there weren't other people telling me what to do, I honestly don't think I would have had the patience to just sit there by myself and figure it out. I would have given up probably once I've gone into town. Like, this is too much. These menus are confusing. Too many weapons. They're too different. Too many combos. I'm done. Um, <clears throat> but now now I think I've already gone past that like initial shock. And now it's like, all right, let's start applying these skills and let's start grinding. So we'll see. We haven't, we haven't encountered a difficult monster yet. Um, when that happens, I might change my tune. Because, <laughs> like, Dark Souls is another franchise I tried to get into and I could never get into. And uh, I'm a little worried that, you know, I feel Monster Hunter is a stepping stone to Dark Souls. So, we'll see. What? What? The, no. the combat, in terms of the speed of combat, the, the no. needing to check out no. the animation, you don't agree. No. You don't agree. No. Not at all. You have to watch, you have to watch your enemies animations roll out of the way attack step and repeat how is that not monster hunter and dark souls in a nutshell because dark souls is a completely different style of gameplay in my opinion okay uh you reminded me um i don't know how much of monster hunter world you played but you know you can name like animals by name so i named my cat what? Bring it, just, yes <laughs> no shit jason you can do that in every fucking monster hunter game okay well i'm using palicos yeah so i named my palico classy and there's a pig in this one and i named the pig poogie crassy after you because you're the you're a cute oh. little pig who gets angry thanks you're welcome i quit, I quit. <laughs> <laughs> All I see is Poogie now. All right. So uh, next we've got um, a new Nintendo Switch console coming out with, uh, sorry, new design uh, with the Monster Hunter Rise Special Edition. I Are want, you buying that? I'm not buying it. And you want to know, know, know why I'm not buying Monster, it? Look at, look, at, look at your leader. <laughs> you new Monster Hunter fan. This guy blows up on Twitch. He's getting... And more YouTube. views on a single Monster Hunter video than he's gotten on his entire channel <laughs> up until this date. And this is how he betrays you. He won't buy a Monster Hunter limited edition system. What, val what value am I going to... Oh, look. This is cool. Everybody knows I've You're been into... You're the Monster it Hunter guy. I'm the Monster Hunter noob on a journey. And you're becoming the guy. Look at look at the chat. Also, Everyone's pissed at you. Also, <laughs> I, think, I, think it's, I think it's ugly. Shame on you. I think it's ugly. That's, 
You dare bite the hand <laughs> that feeds you. And I want to talk about this. You guys think, okay, I'm going to, I'm going to be very, look, we're going to pull up on screen here. Look at I'm this. I'm getting thing. it, Jason. Look at all these patterns. Not. It is so busy. I'm a guy of simplicity. And when you start, you know, just like vomiting all these shapes all over my console and my controller, no thanks. Even if I end up loving Monster Hunter, I would not get this. Now the Pro Controller, the Pro Controller is a very different story. This thing is beautiful. It is the best Pro Controller I've seen available for the Nintendo Switch right now. And this, I might buy. But Pro Controllers are expensive, so I'm not committing to that. Look yeah, at it. Like, look, it, it's nice. It's subtle. You get this nice, like, little golden design on it. That's perfect. This stuff, this stuff, this stuff is not too much. It's too I much. think it's tastefully done. It's not like loud, like in your face. Like it, the designs are, are references back to you know the the characters of the game, like the the culture. I I'd say get it. Get the. Switch get the whole switch, console. Though. No, I'm not getting another switch. I'm holding on for the pro, the switch pro that's coming out later this year. Maybe that's why they're doing so many revisions all of a sudden. Ooh. Gotta get rid of all that stock. That's like when uh remember all those like 2DS and, and 3DS versions came out like right at the end. There was like a Yoshi Good one. Point. Yeah. Like, they just like vomited them and they were so hard to find too. The Galaxy 3DS. I remember they made yeah. a big deal about that. And I was like, why do we care? Oh, I actually remember. I think we didn't know what the Switch was. And people are like, oh, there's an announcement. It was Reggie's like Galaxy 3DS. And everyone thought it was going to be like the, <laughs> the reveal of what the Switch would be. <laughs> Chat was not going crazy, you troll. Yes, they were. There was just very, regular dad. They were very angry. What the fuck, Jay? <laughs> Open face. Shame. Sad. <laughs> Consume. <laughs> Tomato. <laughs> You're the new face. Quit reading your private Tinder messages. This saddens me. <laughs> All right, next. Sorry if you already talked about this, but are you guys going to play Monster Hunter Rise? Yes, I will. I'm undecided. What? <laughs> <laughs> we'll see, probably. Are you still going to be uploading videos now that you're a big-time Monster Hunter <laughs> streamer? <laughs> big time. <laughs> the plan is... <laughs> There's still going to be my usual content. You're just going to get more content now with Monster Hunter. <laughs> so the usual stream is still coming out. Like the usual content stream is still going. But now we're just going to have a parallel Monster Hunter one. Just like, brrr, just going like crazy. Hey, that's a great segue into when Rise comes out too. Assuming I have far enough into Monster Hunter World, yeah. I want to roll credits on World before I get into Rise. I would. <laughs> where where are this is a great question where are the people that were viewing jason on his twitch stream does he not advertise the show on stream i don't know let's ask him i advertised in the discord where a lot of those viewers have now set up shop the discord went from i think about 20 users to 500 users uh very quickly yeah buddy the thing is a lot of the viewers are Hate you. overseas and they're actually asleep right now or they just don't care about a gaming podcast but they could I did not advertise on stream give, give it time give it time one thing at a time we don't we don't have to advertise RGT too fast um are you getting rise Greg yep yep yeah you're gonna rise to the occasion okay. looks dope man I'm, I'm all I like the demo and everything so the sad thing is I wanted to go back, like I would want to go back into the demo after a bit more Monster Hunter hours under my belt, but, you know, they're taking it off. Isn't it coming off the eShop today? Is it? Oh. Does, the, does the demo go off? Even though you have it, like you're still able to play it? Uh, I think it just, because there's a counter on it that you can only play it a certain amount of time, so it probably just like goes zero. Oh, I've only played it a couple. Let me see. Yeah, there's a counter up to like 30. <laughs> Speaking of busy looking switches. Oh, oh, it's so much. <laughs> Fuck you, man. So much. No, I mean, you can like what you like. We all have our preferences, but man, 